Ooh. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> All right, so um, let's get um, your names. I'm Anna Thacker. I'm Kayla Val. And how long you guys been modeling for? Um, I've been doing it for about three years now. And I've been modeling for a year and a half. Year and a half. Okay, cool. Um, so the video that I'm trying to do is for um, people, like photographers, trying to build their portfolio. And, right. Um, trying to, you know, get models to shoot with them. So, what are the things, like, um, that would make you shoot with a photographer? Um, probably just, like, how they message you, like, the professionalism. Um, maybe they come on too strong. Sometimes that's yeah. a reason I wouldn't shoot with them. Um, if they're, like, respectful and about business, and I would definitely want to shoot with them. And also, just the content of their work is really important, too. There you go. Yeah, like, the, I... The first thing I do is, like, if someone messages me first, I look at the structure of their message. If it's professional, yeah. then I'll look at the profile. So, like, what are some, like, <laughs> weirdest um, messages that you get? <laughs> I've had, Let's like... go to the fun stuff. I've had, like, oh, hey, baby, how much money, like, would I have to give you to, like, come shoot with me? Yeah. And I'm, like, um... I'm priceless. No. <laughs> that well, I've had people who aren't even photographers be like, I'll pay $500 tomorrow yeah. for me. And I'm like, And what? my least favorite is like, when a photographer hits me up, I take yeah. that as like, they're willing to pay me for my time. Because yeah. I usually do do paid shoots. Sorry. No, it's okay. No, <laughs> but for like any implied. If like, I don't mind doing like fashion shoots yeah. at all, like for trade. And trade shoots are how you grow. Yeah. And um, so like, if I would say, like, here's my rates, like, they would be, like, straight up, like, I want to do implied. I'd say, okay, here's my rates. They're like, oh, um, well, I don't think you're experienced enough for me to pay you. And it's like, does it matter? You're paying me for my time. Yeah, True. exactly. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, like, let's say somebody hits you up and mm -hmm. you don't want to shoot with them. Like, you know, you see their work or the lack thereof. What are some of the most outlandish lies that you would tell? Just, like, to, <laughs> are you um, nice about it or... I'm I'm pretty nice. Sometimes I don't answer, but, like, um, there's been other times where, like, I've agreed to shoot with people, and they were, like, professional at first, but yeah. then they start Got coming. Yeah, they, yeah, then they get weird and start complimenting every picture you post, and they're, like, sexy, yeah. and then you're, like, yeah. or like, I don't, like, I don't feel comfortable them, shooting, you know yeah. what I mean? So they'll, like, say weird things. Yeah. yeah. So just play cool, like, yeah. don't. Yeah. <laughs> don't overdo exactly. it. Yeah. <laughs> Like, chances are you're probably not going to get together with the model. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's not... She has a boyfriend. That's not what it's for. You, you guys are in the wrong... Yeah, you're you're yeah. creating Wrong art. thing. Like, if, you, if you're trying to get with um, models, trying to get relationship, relationships out of them, and, Just you know, you're, you're... Not the way to do it. Not the way to do it. That's what that's for. Um, so, oh. what are some of the excuses that you would usually give? I sometimes say, like, oh, People sorry, I'm not them. scheduling any shoots right now. Sometimes I say I'm out of town. Yeah, I'm just, <laughs> like, I'm just too busy with school. Mm -hmm. A popular one is sick. Yeah. Or yeah. your mom is sick. Yeah. 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 No, I've definitely used those excuses. Yeah. Definitely. I've pulled some, like, pretty crazy ones. You guys ones ever, like, get problems. any, like, creep ones? Like, just creepy ass messages yeah <laughs> yeah. yeah I've a had lot, people right? that are like some people are sometimes mean and they'll be like yeah and they're like oh like you think you're too pretty like to say hi to me or something like yeah. that and I'm like what are you talking about I just about? don't know who you are it's like, like I don't have to make conversation with every single one of my followers yeah. like yeah. it's time I, think, I also think that it's, it's important to have kind of some kind of like social skills yeah, yeah. Right. you know it's but very very important yeah because I've met a lot of photographers who like I think they just like have a lot of money and they like picked up photography as like a side thing and they yeah. just like oh I'm just gonna say I'm a photographer and then they like have no skills yeah socially or like <laughs> and they just want to shoot like I, I yeah. see like a lot of times like just Don't pictures look at the and just sometimes. like bad quality <laughs> yeah. and it's just like naked woman and I'm like yeah and it's like uh, you're yeah, not a photographer and bad, like, ladies they probably had no idea what they were getting themselves into yeah, yeah. I mean, you get you get a lot of like, you get a lot of photographers who are just kind of like who does boudoir and yeah that kind of stuff that's what they like that's what yeah or they're most photographers guys like themselves. but you know like, yeah. <laughs> yeah but that doesn't get you anywhere I don't think no nope. Um, I think uh, you have to be very personable. Yes. Mm -hmm. Easy to talk to. Like social skills. I mean, you're going to shoot with somebody, right? So mm -hmm. you need some kind of... You need to be good at meeting new people. Right, communication. Communication yeah, is definitely. good. A good communication, not like creepy-ass communication. Yeah. Um, like, and don't start a sentence off with, oh, not to be creepy, but... Because it's always <laughs> creepy! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> That's funny. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> I lost my train of thought right <laughs> just now. <laughs> like, w- okay, so somebody is just starting out building a portfolio, right? Mm-hmm. Um, what would be yeah, photographer or model? Photo- photographers. Mm-hmm. So, what would be your advice as far as like getting my, um, you know, building their portfolio as far as, um, working with models and how to work with models and that kind of stuff? Like, what do you guys like and not like? Um, well, I would say, like, for them, for like advice to give them, like, I would definitely hit up other photographers and say, like, hey, can I go on a shoot with you and, like, could you teach me some things? And, like, yeah. then you can meet models that way, too. Or, like, practice on, like, your family members and yeah. friends. Family and, like, members, then yeah. when other people see your content and, like, see that yeah. it's good, even yeah. if the person's not a model, you can still tell if a picture's good or not. Yeah. So, Correct. Like, Very much so. Yeah, I mean, family members are not going to judge you. Just don't ask yeah. them to do boudoir and that stuff. Yeah. yeah. That kind of stuff. It's kind of weird. And, like, follow, like, who you are. Like, don't try yeah. to be someone else. Because, yeah. like, it shows in your work. Yes, you develop to, like, your own style. Because yeah. when I, like would try shoots that are, like, were different, and, like, it's not me, like, you can tell in my pictures. <laughs> like, yeah. it's just not for me. What do you mean? <laughs> like, you just tell my face. Like, it's, like, I don't really know what I'm doing. Okay. Yeah. Um, what do you guys, what are your thoughts uh, as far as, like, editing? Like, you know, like, what's your perfect level of how you like to be edited? Um, I don't Ooh. like when my forehead is changed. Like, I've literally had a photographer, like, morph my forehead, and that's, like, my biggest insecurity. So, like, that was just, like, a big shot, like, yeah. in the foot. <laughs> yeah. But I like skin smoothing a lot. <laughs> yeah, I like, I like skin smoothing, but some and photographers toning. overdo Over it really? so much. And I have some pictures on my Instagram about. where, like, <laughs> it looks like I just, like, I look like, like, just airbrush yeah, completely. It and it looks like very flat. fake. But, like, yeah. it sucks because I don't want my followers to think that, like, I'm editing my photos that's like that. True. But, like, I have to post it the way that the photographer edited it because yeah. that's, yeah. The, like, what I sign like, for so I have like photographers that like will send me like emails every week saying here's some more pictures to post please 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 post and I'm like please whoa so like, like you're marketing I, for them yeah no <laughs> you already shoot with, sh- yeah, shot with them yeah exactly that's and crazy it's just like I can't put up the same pictures from the same shoots con- like in the yeah. yeah I have to break it up you have an aesthetic you gotta stick with yeah. <laughs> so if you don't have a lot of work like uh, yeah, for, uh, for a photographer you, know, mm-hmm. you just space your posts out just yeah space them out know. and you can edit them different like make them look different you yeah. can like yeah. change a lot of stuff like, I've definitely color-wise. gone through a lot of um, I, I've changed a lot like you, you see my earlier posts yeah. mm-hmm. um, I've changed a lot too in my like yeah. you can see like my modeling group. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to be more consistent yeah me um, too I'm trying to like develop an aesthetic in my page so what are the things that you guys like that photographers do during a shoot that mm. helps out coaching with, yeah coaching? telling like put your head down yeah, or like where say, to put your yeah. ar- like hands arms or they like show I like when they like show you the pictures okay they're like okay like can you try to do this but like yeah. do this like a this way yeah like, that's this really is where helpful. we're at you know yeah, yeah I think showing something. like the photos like midway in between a shoot like you can like see yeah. firsthand like what yeah. you're doing wrong and what you're doing right and like kind of like change it I actually worked with a photographer yesterday who literally did not let me look he's like no peeking and I was like <laughs> no, what <laughs> yeah but my friend peeked and she said oh. that they looked really good so I was like yeah. okay cool and he was also coaching so like I knew he knew what he was looking at he's like okay <laughs> there's a shadow here I need you to move your head like this way yeah some photographers are all different mm-hmm. like some photographers are com- yeah. comfortable with just showing their work some photographers would delete any, any photos that they don't like yeah and some, maybe like you know, five <laughs> yeah oh yeah, yeah. I, I know um, yeah I know somebody who does that you know who you are um, <laughs> what are some of the things that photographers do that you're absolutely not too crazy about when they don't send you all the photos yeah like yeah. Don't, they don't send originals with yeah the, or they send unedited, you unedited, the, yeah. yeah now does it matter if it's TFP or not no no what if it's TFP I think I think TFP you're like the models are entitled to all the photos. That's what I, yeah, I that's feel like. What I yeah. Think so. yeah, I definitely think that if the model is getting paid, then like the photo- photographer definitely has more of a say. Yeah, in yeah what has to do the pictures. Yeah, because that's business. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Um, like at least give me some. Yeah, because they, they send their <laughs> favorites, and that might not be too. your favorites. That's true. Because right. like yeah. you have a certain way of like looking at yourself. Like you're, you're if, on, your own worst critics. Yeah. You yeah. Are, exactly. Yeah. Like your you might look at critic. a photo of yourself and be like, I hate this, but it's like your photographer's favorite one, and yeah, that's happened to me like, so many why? times. I'm like, <laughs> yes. I don't like it actually it. happened in my first shoot ever. <laughs> yeah. No, like, you. It's me. <laughs> you know what? Like I've I've been shooting with models for for two years or two and a half years or so. Roughly, you know, roughly. I've done fashion show. 
girls have done um, studio work and tutorial stuff. Now, um, and it's very rare that models are like, hey, I don't, I don't like this photo that you've posted. It's very rare. It's weird. Yeah. I prefer if they do. Really? I actually do. Okay, because yeah. I always wonder about that because, like, yeah. I've had, like, photographers post some pretty iffy ones, and I'm like, oh, I hate yeah. that one, please. Yeah. Just, I mean, if you're nice about it, mm-hmm. like, cool, like, eh, I'm yeah. not too crazy yeah. about it. And it's like, some, most of the time, it's not even the picture, it's just, like, me yeah, like, in yes. the picture, like, yeah. a face that I'm making or something. That you don't like, because, you know, like you said, like, yeah. you know, you're, yourself yeah. is your worst critic. Definitely. You know? um, and, yeah, definitely... If a model doesn't like their photo, okay, cool. We'll also scrap that. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's why, like, if I'm doing TFP, I, appreciate that. Yeah, I, yeah. Definitely I send like the that. models every single photo, and then they tell me what they like. Yeah. That way, um, I can I just pretty much edit what I like too. So you have a lot more to, to choose from. You know? Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. I respect that. It's very symbiotic relationship. <laughs> yeah. So what's a what's a good time frame for you know a photographer to okay send you some photos like, at least it's like a week something or two. To tickle. Yeah. A week or two. Yeah. I mean, I've had photos, like, the next day, and I've had yeah. photos, like, two months later, so, like... People are not patient yeah. people. I mean, it's it's normal, like, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, um, I know people have lives, like, photography's usually, like, a hobby for most people, yeah. so, like, editing takes a while. Mm-hmm. Give the model something, like, at least yeah. one or two photos... Yeah, yeah definitely. ...as soon as the, the shoot is done. Right, like, yeah, that, when you guys are yeah. shooting, like, just, like, go, go through them together and have her, like, pick out, like, one or two, yeah. him mm-hmm. or her. <laughs> because that's also how you get models to shoot with you again. Right, like, yeah. Know, like, just having, okay, you know, you, you're yeah. straightforward. Like, models, exactly. reference check. They yeah. do. I've had me- multiple models message me, say, hey, is this photographer good? Like, mm-hmm. do they do this, this, and this? Like, a lot of things we're talking yeah. about now. Have you guys I'll ever you. <laughs> have you guys ever had a, like, a, a, a just a shoot that goes south? I cried at one. You cried at one? I cried at one because Why? it was my first shoot, like, where I was going to, like, try implied topless. And, like... So I worked with these photographers for like over two years now. They're great people. It's they're it's not them. <laughs> um, he was, they were a little weird at first. I thought, but like I'm very I was new to the industry at that point. Yeah. So like I really didn't know like what I was like dealing with, and there, I've actually like gotten really close with other photographers. But like I was posing with this like skeleton, like fake skeleton, and he had like his little fake bony hands all over my boobs, and they said, okay. Now let's remove your hands and Mr. Bones' hands from your breasts. And, like, I just, like, had an anxiety attack and started crying. Yeah. And they're like, just put your shirt on, put your shirt on, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> like, we don't have to do anymore, we can be done. Well, so, like, I they mean, were cool about that, but If it, was it was implied, me. like, you know, like, was that what you were trying to, they were trying to go for just implied? I was not expecting a topless shoot. I was expecting, yeah. expecting an implied shoot. So, like, that's why I was implied like, I don't want to totally move. different, yeah. Yeah, I don't want to move, like, this away. Yep. Like, but... All as well. And you? Like, what's your um, worst shoot ever? Well, I was at a shoot once, and it's happened to her too, but same same person. But <laughs> the dog <laughs> ate both of our underwear, and we had to go <laughs> the rest hands? of the shoot What were you guys wearing? <laughs> what? No, like, we just, like, were changing, and, like... <laughs> the dog ripped it in half, and it was, like... He, he like, was just there. chewing on it, and he ended up biting my hand when I tried to take it out. Yeah, he, like, went rotted on us. Yes! And, like, this other time I was shooting at the PMA, the Philadelphia Museum of Art, in two degree weather. That's the one I was telling you about. That's what you're but this about photographer earlier. didn't tell me that the Philadelphia Museum of Art, we were shooting outside of it, not inside, because it was closed that day. So I didn't. I had to change against like a cement, like brick wall behind a reflector, and literally like the day before it snowed like two feet. <laughs> it was That's terrible. Rough. It was terrible. Especially like, it was out. Definitely outside, like yeah, communicate outside, your yeah. location and ex- expectations and like wardrobe. Yeah. So basically, you know, location, time, weather is very important. Very yeah. much so. Especially for, you know, trade fours. Mm-hmm. Like, remember, trade fours is, you know, both sides get something. Yeah. So, you know, models get something, and then you get something. Right. And without models, you won't get nothing. I mean, models can always get somebody else to take photos and that kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. Which is becoming easier and easier with phones and, yeah. you know, that kind of nonsense. Um, Still not the same as this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so how was, how was our shoot today? It was awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Had a great time. I'm so glad you hit me up. Yes. <laughs> great. I'm yes. glad you brought me. Yes, I'm <laughs> so glad that you came. My other friend Natasha was supposed to come, but like she had uh, an interview. No, I mean, you know, I'm, yeah. I'm here every now and then. Hit me so up we'll next time. Yeah, shoot. definitely. Hopefully it's not as windy the next time. Yeah, yeah. anyway. It was so windy. Yeah. yeah. So, so. We did good, you know. But um, it was fun. We'll show some of the sh- uh, BTS and... 
like Sweet. finished edited stuff mm-hmm. after this Sweet. thing awesome. right here or pop right here or whatever. <laughs> um, cool. So Instagram handles for Kayla. K A Y B A Y one zero one one zero one K B one zero one. Cool. Mine's Anna Myung A N N A M as in Mary Y U N as in Nancy G. Okay, so it'll be just right here. You just we'll spell it out. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it'll just show up right there. Oh. Alright, cool. So I don't get carried away to be buried and lay in the dirt. My man, for what it's worth, I try to put everybody that I love first.